Hello, North families, and welcome back to the Glorious God and Glorious Gospel uh, video series. I just wanted to highlight a couple of things that we'll be moving on to in our week two study. You know, last week we had an opportunity to focus in on the centrality of God's Word. And we looked at to understand that God's Word, the Bible, isn't just history, it isn't just story, it's the full revelation of God to us. Which leads us to a very important question of who is this God? In week two of our study, we'll be looking at this question to understand more completely who God is and what his character is for us. You know, it's so important as Christians that we are grounded and our churches are rooted in a complete understanding of God. How we think, uh, how we worship, even how we serve will all be influenced by the knowledge and understanding of who we think God is in our lives. As Pastor Travis talked about in this sermon last week, you might have two people doing the exact same duties and roles and responsibilities as a Christian, but only one of them might truly know the character and heart of God. And so I challenge you this week, as you get into this study with your families, be mindful to think through who is God in your life. Uh, as, we, as we look at a number of different passages, how is God revealing himself in Scripture? And while God's fullest revelation is given to us in Jesus Christ, God has been revealing himself in Scripture from Genesis to Revelation. And that full entirety of God the Father, God the Spirit, and God the Son is who God is. I hope you guys can be challenged and encouraged this week and be you know, enjoying your time together. It was such a treat for me to be able to be with my family and spend some focused time together in God's Word, having discussions coloring some pages and just learning together. And so I pray your blessing on this week as you guys continue to study. I also want to throw a plug in just get you guys thinking about November 11th. Save that date on your calendar. That will be when our next uh, in-person event will be at the church. And we'll be just looking at uh, missionaries and the missionary work of our church and how we as families can be a part and support that. And so be looking uh, on the Elevate website uh, and the North News 